Welcome back to EA Sports, everybody. I'm James Savalski, and the battle on the ice should be ferocious as it always is in the American Hockey League here. Centers are lined up. Official ready to drop the puck. The crunch have established possession here early in this one as they win the draw. Taken along the wall by Bellows. Here's a chance. Sends it out in front. Oh, and he comes up with a stop. Bellows works it around near the point. Here's a pass in front, and that doesn't connect. Here's Stars! What a finish on the play! Well, the shutout streak's gonna come to an end, but you gotta give the credit to the goaltender. I mean, how impressive has he been, James? I mean, he has been a wall between the crease. The Bruins couldn't have asked for a better start here tonight as they are on the board still early in the first. Yeah, they get their legs underneath them right from the opening faceoff. They get multiple lines into the game and they just kept building momentum and they're rewarded with that first goal of the game. along the wall and he loses both the puck and his balance after that hit here's a chance to the middle and that's intercepted stretch pass dumps the puck in the Bruins get a hold of the puck along the boards look out oh what a hit in order to dictate the tempo of the game right at the onset of it, you want to make your opponent think and hear you coming, and that's what he does with that first hit. Can hang on to the puck after taking a knock. Moves it to SMO. And a tenacious effort pays off as he comes up with it. Schmitz moving it ahead. Sends it into the offensive zone. Providence is looking to break out. And he takes the pass. Sends the pass in front. And he denies that great opportunity there. And they'll battle for that loose puck along the boards. Syracuse has it. Finley's taking it from his own end. Scoops up the puck now. Shot! Great glove save! Kaiser's got the puck and will hang on for the whistle. Well, he hasn't been busy, James, but he makes a key save right there. Really important that he keeps his head and focus in the game. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. We've got a 1-0 hockey game thus far. Oh, big time save by Kaiser. Sends it in front. Oh, and they couldn't complete that. Finley's on the attack in the offensive zone. My goodness, the pressure really building here in the offensive end.
The Bruins are on cruise control here in period number one, Cheryl. Yeah, they've got a two-goal lead late in this first period. It's exactly the start they wanted to. They've been pressing all game, but they can't get complacent. They've got to continue to push. Moves it to the middle, and he shuts down a great scoring chance there. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. Providence has got it in the neutral zone. Hall's going to play it against the half wall. There's the whistle as the goalie hangs on. Past the midway mark in this period. Providence has been the better team here over the last few minutes, increasing their lead to two. Solid check to slow him down. To the low slot. Simple glove save by Kaiser. Takes the feed. And now he tries to get it across to O'Connor. Centering to the middle. And that goes off a stick. Here he is from the slow. Scores. And they're cooking now. Uh, the opponent has no answer for them right now because they're relentless on the puck. They garnered some momentum after multiple back-to-back -back goals, James. They don't want to leave any breathing room and let their opponent get some life back. Here in the late goings of the period, Providence has been showing relentless pressure lately, now up by three. Sorella's gained possession inside the neutral zone. Takes a shot. Stopped by the goaltender, getting a piece of that one. Nice speed from the left side up the middle. Johansson's got the puck, and he's going to hang on. Centers get set as they're ready to drop the puck again. Sorella's won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Syracuse looks to break out in their own end. Handles the puck. There's a shot. Denies him with the save. Heads to the back of the net. Now a quick pass to Stevens. Can't maintain possession. Kaiser's going to hang on to the puck for a whistle. Isimont's the leader of this team, James. They're getting blown out right now. you got to look at it as a game within a game, winning this offensive zone faceoff and trying to get a quick punch on net. Here's an odd man rush. Sends the feed in front. And that doesn't go as it's off a stick. Olivier is looking to make something happen here in the corner. Quick pass to Bellows. The Bruins will play it against the boards. Takes a shot. And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Johansson's made a really nice save here. Looks like he's dialing back in. If he can get back to the performance he had the other night, I mean, a shutout, you can't get much better than that. He just needs to find a way to build on top of that save. Puck sent over to Olivier. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Here he is on the backhand. And he hangs on just as time. There's the horn, still 40 more minutes left in regulation time. We'll get to the second period right after this. Both teams back on the ice, they're lined up, and period number two is about ready to go. A one-sided affair thus far. Let's see if anything changes here with the start of the second. Well, Cheryl, how do you sum this one up through the first 20 minutes? Providence's game plan was executed perfectly in the first 20 minutes, James. I mean, they were first to the puck. When you're first to it and you retrieve it, you own it. Then they managed it. Then they found ways to attack the net. Now they've got a healthy lead heading into the second. We're still in the early stages of this period. Providence has got a 3-0 lead. They have been in control right from the start. And he takes the feed. Poked away and forces the turnover at center. Look at this, they've got some bodies here on the attack. And he was locked in on that save as play continues. Johansson's got to make more stops like that, James. He's got to reset the momentum for his team. I mean, it's not about what happened or the present moment. It's about the next save, and that's the key contributor to reset this team and get them moving forward. Puck possession so critical in today's game, and the official ready to drop the puck right here. And they take possession after the defensive zone faceoff. 
drags him in. Slick feed. And it's a quick pass to Thompson. And that goes off the player in front. The Bruins have it against the wall. Puck is picked up here in the neutral ice by Mackey. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Sends the pass in front. And he'll hang on to it to regroup here for a moment. To the front. Oh, he didn't get out of it, but just enough to keep it out of the net. Kirk's won the draw. Syracuse gains a hold of it. And now they look to make something happen from the neutral zone. Moves it quickly over to Kaiser. Offside the call. We'll get a face-off coming up. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. The Bruins are in cruise control, leading it 3-0. And off the face-off, they take possession. Mitchell's got it in the offensive zone. Knocked away. Only oh, gets a blocker on it. What a stop by Johansson. And that's broken up. And he takes the feed. Takes it into the slot. And the save. Slides the pass over to Blitzbell. Taken by Mitchell. Here they come on the attack. To his teammate. Here's a chance behind the net. And he comes up big with the stick save, getting all of it with the power. I really like the save, James, because he challenges the shooter who's all alone in the slot area. He turns aside a real dangerous opportunity. Providence has had the better scoring opportunities and lots of them, which is why they lead in a big way here in the second. Browns won the faceoff here in the offensive zone. Here we go, pucks in deep. Walsh is lugging the puck. Here's a short pass to O'Connor. Providence has got the puck against the boards. The Crunch have taken possession along the wall. Providence is trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Syracuse looks to move the puck from their own end. Swap up. From the neutral zone now. Edmonds is hauled down. The official's arm is up. And there's the whistle stopping the play. O'Connor's getting two for tripping. Syracuse gets set to go to work on the power play for the first time tonight. No, they haven't scored on the power play yet. 100% is not a number that you see typically. So they've got to find a way to just stay confident, trust the process and their skill sets. Centering feed! And that's a great heads-up play in the offensive zone. Great use of the body to knock him off the puck. On the attack along the boards. Great save by the goaltender on that redirect. And he takes the dish. Oh, wow! Stops him again! And now he moves it quickly to Hall. And he's knocked off the puck there. Blocked in traffic. Usau's gaining momentum. Quick feed to Osimo. Oh, and somehow he gets a sliver of it and keeps him at bay. This shot's come from the middle of the ice, and it has some heat on it, but he's ready and waiting for it. He's to position, and he makes the save. The Crunch have gained control of the puck along the wall, and they continue to apply pressure here. Center and feed. And that chance is blocked. And he elects to play the puck. O'Connor's almost out of the box. Both sides are evened up now as the power play expires. That's a great job on the power play. Maybe you could have had a little net front presence in order to screen the goaltender. As you know, the goaltender came up huge there with all those chances. Takes the shot. Oh, how did he keep it out? What a blocker stop by Kaiser. And he connects with the long bomb. Olivier's team is flying out there, James. I mean, this is a blowout. Bruins 
have been moving and grooving all night long, and we're only in the second period here, Bounder. Well, they're finding a way to get the puck, and that's because they're retrieving it. But when they get it, they're keeping it. They're not letting anyone have it, and the motion in the offensive zone has been incredible, and the score is a result. He's got two goals already. Puck's on his stick. He's hunting his third. Handles the puck at the point. Oh, I think that went off his mask and somehow stays out the net. Goaltenders try and make themselves as big as possible, and it usually hits other parts of the body, but this one rattles right off the cage. Centering pass. A blast. The Bruins gain control of the puck. Steps inside the attacking zone down the left wing. I oh, he whiffs. Pass out front. The Bruins get a hold of the puck in the open ice. With possession along the wall. Moves it to the middle. Oh, he comes up with a stop. In front and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Just here in the late stages of this frame, the Bruins are on the cusp of making this a blowout, leading by four. Good job tangling up his opponent here. Providence has got it now. Moves it to Chalarski. Gains the zone from the right side. The Bruins play it along the wing. Grabs possession of the puck. Over the net. You gotta get a shot on that, James. You get in tight, you have an opportunity in that scoring area, and you don't even get a shot on net. Not good enough. Fire it! shot! Big stop! Just as time expires in the period. There's the buzzer, two periods down, one more to go. They always say three is the magic number. We've got period number three next. Welcome back, James Sabalski, ready to bring you all the play-by-play. -play. Third period underway here. This has been a total squash to this point. Well, two periods down. Here we go with the third period. Cheryl, your assessment so far. Syracuse is trailing entering the third period here, and the only way it's going to change is they start having some urgency around the puck and be confident when they get it. I mean, really, the numbers in terms of possession are really low, James, and they haven't been able to generate any offense at all. That needs a change if they want to get back in the game. Locos hauled down. Penalty on the way. And the players whistle dead. Here's the call. I just had a gander at the bench and the energy and the body language. I mean, they're defeated, James, and now they have to kill off another penalty down a bunch of... Scores! Another one, and listen to these fans now. Cheryl, they don't like it one bit. Oh, they don't like it, James. It is ugly inside the building. You couldn't get anything going on the ice, and even harder when your own fans are booing. One of the toughest things to do is get in and get entry, and when you already have a face-off in the offensive zone, you got to find a way to execute on the power play. You know, it's one of the most difficult things to do, but when you win possession, you can get the setup. You can get the look that you want, and that's what happened here. The Bruins continue to bring up the score here in period number three. It's just been a terrific collective effort. Now they're on the home stretch, and the coaching staff has a real opportunity to utilize their bench, rest their star players, and this is critical when you're in a long season. Syracuse takes hold of the puck. Here they come. And a good use of the body to knock the puck loose. Now he takes it over the line. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. Pokes it away in his own end. Makes his presence known on the ice. Puck picked up by Wolcott. Smart heads up play to neutralize the threat. Quick pass to Blitzfeld. Centering pass. Off the stick and they can't complete the play. Poked away by Loco. Gaining steam inside the neutral zone. A feed on front. Oh, what a chance, and that goes off target. McCarthy's got the puck in his own zone. Oh, he got rocked and ducked right into his own bench. Well, he's got it. Oh, my goodness, it stayed out. What a save. It was all but in, James, and that athleticism and the will to get to that puck, that was on display. Picked up along the boards by Walcott. Providence has got possession at center. Directs it on over to Mitchell. And they send it right back to him. 
Laukel's got it along the wing. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. And that's knocked away. Puck scooped up by Walcott. And now it's grabbed by Schmidt. Great use of the stick at center by Usal. Walcott's swinging the puck through center ice. And he hangs on to the puck. Tremendous stop by Kaiser. The Thunderbirds have been extremely strong defensively tonight. They protected the interior of the ice. They pushed everything to the perimeter, and now they're protecting the shutout. Takes the pass. Pass to Brown. Slides the puck down low. Into the corner, he takes the pass. Snaps it onto the net. Gives them nothing in front. Here he is in close. And the traffic neutralizes that threat. Pokes the puck away. Trying to clear. And they get the puck out of the zone and they'll go for a breather. Uh, this is exactly what they needed. You get fresh legs out there. You also get fresh minds. And you need both to win, James. Puck grabbed by Usa. Strong defensive effort. Scooped up along the wall by Walsh. Handles the pass. Receives the pass. Up the neutral zone now. The Crunch have the puck against the boards. Element stick handling in his own zone. And loses possession after a solid hit. Stopped by the goaltender. And now it's to Mackey. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Providence has got a hold of the puck. Handles it again. Providence is in now. Stoppage in play, offside the call. Belleville's up next on the schedule. Tickets still available. Go to the box office or you can get them online. Here in the late going of the frame, the Bruins all over them tonight. They lead it 5-0. Kurtz, quick stick, lands on the puck here at center. Into the offensive end now. Sends the feet in front. And he denies that great opportunity there. Centering feed. The shot. Quick stop by Johansson. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. See if we can pick up some momentum again here as a face-off is ready to go. Lauko's got it, and they'll go on the attack here in the offensive zone. Covers it up, we'll get a stoppage in play. Offensive zone face off, and he wins the draw. And cut that one out of the net. Ref blows the whistle as the puck's covered up. Providence has put in one of their most complete efforts that we have seen in quite some time, up big time late in this third. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Oh, and it just gets a piece of it to keep it out. Great positioning by the goaltender to redirect it to the corner, getting it out of danger. Walcott's got it along the boards. Gets the puck in deep. Picked up along the wall by Ismo. Clouds him with the glove. The Bruins move the puck in the defensive zone. Gaining momentum along the wing. 